15 overs. That's those are the overs where you need to keep striking. You need good head on the shoulders when you're chasing a score as stiff as 161. They've lost three wickets um, in your first power play. Chennai Rhinos, they've got their tail up. Easy, easy. Kind of temperament needed when you're chasing a score. You have to keep up the run rate, also make sure you don't lose too many wickets. So temperament is all that counts when you're chasing a run run as stiff uh, as 161. This is I think the last pair um, that can help them to get closer to the target. They don't have too much of depth in the batting lineup. They were so heavily dependent on uh, Rajiv and Paskar and also Dhruv. Provide them with the big runs. Inside edge, with only a single. But somehow in the finals, in such a tight situation, under pressure, the top two players, the opener is uh, held up well. That's what happened. Raji went for the big lead, missed the line completely, and then Bhaskar. So the top guns are uh, back in the hut. The last one to go was uh, Pradeep. That was an uh, excellent delivery from Santana. What has happened here, Saba, is uh, that they have all these matches, they have uh, really relied heavily on Rajiv and Bhaskar. Uh, they have provided them the impetus, they have provided them with the beginnings. And, uh, suddenly, the middle order haven't played that much of a part. They have played a supporting role to Rajiv and Bhaskar right throughout the tournament. Till they reach the final, and suddenly they find themselves in the finals without Rajiv and Bhaskar who are back in the pavilion. This is where their depth will count, their batting depth. And these two really put on a good show. Something quite similar to what happened to the Royal Challengers Bangalore in the IPL last season. It was Chris Gale who did all the job for them the entire season. In the finals, the moment he faltered, the rest of the side crumbled. And that's what has happened today. They're going up. With the appeal, and, uh, the umpire is uh, not sure what is happening. They've asked for a for a review here. The Chennai Rhinos. I'm not too sure. Was the umpire checking whether the ball was taken cleanly by the glove man or not? And have they asked for a decision review? Yes, I think they are um, just want to check if the catch was taken cleanly or not by Ramanna, the wicket keeper. That uh, tells you that uh, there definitely was a nick. Oh, that's a good call from the umpire to go upstairs. The ball has uh, clearly fallen short of the keeper. There is a bounce there, just ahead of uh, the glove. So it's <laughs> Activity there. There's so many supporters in the dugout. They're enjoying this. They're on top at this stage. Now, what are they waiting for? The umpire did well uh, there to go upstairs and refer it to the third umpire. So back again with some action. 
Last ball coming up of the seventh over. Drives it uh, nicely to long off. He misfields. They go for two runs. This is done twice in the over. After seven, it's 42 for three.